Hey everybody, I'm Ebony. This is Ebony's Creativity. I want to thank you for stopping by and uh, viewing this video on my channel. This is my first video. So, I hope that I will become one of your favorite YouTubers. You can expect from me um, DIYs, room tours, probably a few chit chat, advice. Uh, you give me advice or I give you advice, Q&As. Um, cleaning, decorating, whatever you want to see. I do it all. I love to build furniture. I love to do DIYs. I love to buy stuff for the low. I love to thrift. You can also expect thrift hauls. Whatever I'm doing, I'm more than happy to show it to you. So you can let me know in the comments what you're into. Let's get this channel going. I'm excited. I got some great content coming for you. But for today, what we are going to do is a Pier 1 haul. Now, Pier 1 is having a clearance sale right now, and it is additional 40% off of clearance items. So the clearance is already pretty good, but with an additional 40% off, I'm not normally a Pier 1 shopper because I like to go to the thrift store, get my stuff for the low, bring it home, do it up, and make it look like Z Gallery or West Elm quality. That's the name of my game, saving a penny whenever I can. But even I had to splurge a little bit on this Pier 1 sale because I was able to find multiples of things. The store was organized. I found a lot of things in my color scheme, which is black and white and gold. I love black and white. I love texture on texture. I love mixing textures. A lot of people like mixing colors. I love to mix textures. So in my home, as we get more into the room tours, you will notice that I have lots of black and white, but different textures different patterns. I love that. So let me go ahead and get into this haul. Like I said, additional 40% off, but it ends in two days. So that's on July 31st. But even if you miss that sale, you should be able to find some good deals in there because they have a lot of good stuff in there right now. So the first item I'm going to show is this pillow. I did get two of them. It's called the Abstract Diamond Pillow. The original price was $19.99, so $20. Bucks. The sale price was $11.98. And with an additional 40% off of that, I got these pillows for $7.19. And I don't really think you can beat that. So here's these pillows. I'm not sure where they will go, but I really like the way they look for some reason. I love the tassels. None of my other pillows have tassels, which is shocking to me because I have a ton of pillows in this house. But I don't know. I just like it. It called to me. It's only 7 bucks. I can find somewhere to put it. If not um, in the new couch, which I'm expecting the delivery of a new couch, which will be my pop-up color in this living room within the next week or two. So I will be so excited when that comes. You guys, it is a beautiful couch. I cannot wait. But for now, I'm just collecting stuff. I'm going to be doing a pretty much a makeover of my living room. Um, I've had black and white in here, black, white, and gold. And the pop of color has been red for years. So I am going to change that out. I have a beautiful teal sofa on the way. I cannot wait to receive it. I have been waiting for six weeks, y'all. Six weeks. Like, I done paid for it. Where my couch at? But anyways, back to this Pure One haul. This pillow was $7.19, originally $20 or $19.99. So I really like that. The next item I'm going to show you is going to be this vase. They have it advertised as a candle holder. Um, I'm going to use it for a vase. The original price on here was $29.99. And it was um, on clearance for $20.98. So after the additional 40% off, I paid $12.59 for this vase. Now, in person, it's giving me a little bit of a pink hue. In the store, it did not do that. I'm not sure why it is. But it looks more clear in person than pink. But I do see like a pink hue to it right now. 
So I'm not sure what that's all about, but I have a perfect spot for this. I've been looking for like a substantial piece that I can put in my home. I have a perfect spot for it. So I'm keeping these. I mean, for $12.59, I don't even think I can DIY anything for cheaper than that or thrift anything. Not for anything this substantial. And I did get two. So here's the other. And this is what the inside looks like. Just to give you kind of a 360. It's really nice. It's thick, heavy glass. It's not cheaply made. And I really love the gold on the bottom. I don't know what kind of flowers I'm going to put. Unfortunately, they didn't have any stems on sale, which would have been really great for me because I need stems for a lot of this stuff. But I'll go to Hobby Lobby or pick some up somewhere else. Probably have some in this house somewhere. I am a decor hoarder. So I'm sure I'll be able to find some. Not quite sure what flower. Um, Maybe some hydrangeas would be pretty. Maybe some chrysanthemums because I am born in November and that is my birth flower. So I don't know. I don't know, but we'll see. But I love those. And for $12.59, I couldn't leave it there. Like, you don't understand. I am not a pure one shopper. A girl has to save her coins. But on this day, I splurged. So, the next item I'm going to show you is this hexagonal wine rack. So, the original price on this was $24.99. The clearest price is $17.98. And with the additional 40% off, I paid $10.79 for this. And I think it would look really good on my bar cart with some wine bottles in it. Um... There's no telling if it will stay there once I get to looking at something and I can see a different use for it. Sometimes my DIY spidey senses go crazy. But for right now, I'm going to try it on the bar cart. Uh, in some coming videos, you will see some of these items styled. So if it doesn't end up there, I will show you where it does end up. But um, I thought that was pretty cute. Okay, so the next item I'm going to show are these vases. Yes, I love black and white. Like I said, black and white here, black and white here, black and white over there. Black and white is everywhere, and I love gold as well. So with this, I have a perfect spot for it that needs some black and white because it has a lot of gold. But I think I'm going to put a maybe a gold band on here, maybe around the middle or at the top or at the bottom. I'm not sure. Maybe a ribbon. Maybe I'll do it with spray paint or acrylic paint. I'm not sure. But I might leave it how it is, depending on what stems I find to put in it. So I don't know quite at this moment where I will do the go if I do it. But I just really like this. And for the price, it was not staying at Pier 1. It had to come home with me. So here is this. And the original price was $24.99. The clearance price is $14.98. And after the sale, I paid $8.99 for this. And I did get two of them. So here's the other one. All right. So let me find a spot to put those down. It's getting crowded around my feet. All right, the next thing I want to show you is this candle holder. If you hear me sniffling, I'm so sorry. I'm getting over a cold. I don't know what is going on because it is hot outside. But leave it to me to get a cold in the summertime. I don't know why. Excuse me if you hear me sniffling. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so this candle holder I think is pretty cute. I don't have anything like this in my house, so I decided to pick it up. It has, it's coming off a little bit more brown on cam than it is in person. Like more grayish, brownish, beige. I don't know, but in person it's pretty 
black and white and it has some splashes of cream in it but it has a glass piece and then this bottom piece here and it just goes like that i'm thinking about putting this on my mantle i'm not really sure right now but like i said whenever i do find a spot for these items i'll be sure to show you um this was originally $14.99 and on clearance for $11.18. And so after the sale, I paid $6.71 for this item. And I did get two of them. So here is the one. I'm thinking also about doing a little gold in here. I don't know. I don't want to go too crazy with the gold and black and the white. Everything doesn't have to have all three colors, but... Um, that's what that looks like, and I did get two of them. I'm going to take the glass off so we don't have any accidents in here right now. But here is one, and here is two. So hopefully I'll find somewhere to put that. The next item I got is this vase, which I think is so pretty. I love mercury glass, and this is giving me a mercury glass vibe. So, I really like it. Um, that's how the inside looks. And it's just the same all the way around. Um, the original price on this was $34.99. And the clearance price is $19.18. So, with the additional 40% off, I paid $11.51 for this vase. And I think this would be cute as a centerpiece on my uh, dining room table or... Um, as decor on top of my buffet in the dining room. So I'm saying that now, but knowing me, it'll end up in the dining room. I love moving everything around. I get tired of looking at stuff in the same place, and I just get to moving, redecorating, making over, DIYing. I can't help myself. So right now, that's what I bought this for, was to put it on the dining room table. But once I get those stems in there and see how it's looking, it could end up anywhere to be honest so i thought that was really cute and at a good price so i did pick that up as well Alrighty, and i think this is my last item that went so fast you guys i've been have been anticipating starting a youtube channel for years and i just never did it but now i feel like i don't want to stop this video but i do only have one more item to show you so that is this mirror and I will not put it forward and attempt not to blind you because there's lots of light in here but this is what it looks like and I think it's pretty cute um, the original price on it $59.99. Y'all. No ma'am, pure one. No ma'am. $59.99 for this. And this is not even one of the heavier items. Like, it's cute and all. But not for $59.99. But anyway, the clearance price was $23.98. And I paid, let's see. $14.39 for this mirror. So that's more like it. It is cute though. And I have a perfect spot to put this. Um, so I have a, a built-in that I did in my living room. And I need some items for the bottom shelf. So I think that would be cute down there. Um, this living room, you will get a tour. But this living room is in disarray until my couch comes. I have pushed the old couches out of their space. I put down the new rug. I'm ready for my couch. I'm just waiting on these people to bring me my couch. So you'll get the living room tour after that. Um, so you will see most of these items in that tour. So just be patient with me. Please share my video. Go to Pier 1. Get you an additional 40% off. Let a friend know about me. I'm Hopefully, I'll be here to stay. We're going to see how this goes. I'm excited right now about it. So we're going to just go with that. I have a lot to share. I do DIYs, like I said. 
Um, I love DIYs. I love making furniture. I love doing anything that I've not done before. So we're going to go on this adventure together. Please help me get my channel going by commenting, liking, subscribing, sharing my video. Go to Pier 1. Check it out. Most clearance sales do not have multiples of things. So I was able to find two of pretty much everything I got. So I'd say it's a pretty good sale. You know, Pier 1 is very clean and organized. You don't have to be rummaging through to find stuff like us thrifters are used to doing. So that was a, a good break from what I'm used to. Um, oh, just in case you'd like to know, total I spent $107.65. So including the tax, my total was $114.11. So I think I did pretty good. I mean, for 11 items from Pier 1, 114, you can't beat that with a stick. So go to Pier 1. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully, you were able to catch this video before the sale was over. But even if not, some of these prices were really good uh, before the sale. So I tried to give you all the prices. I hope I didn't forget any. If you have any questions, you can leave them down below. Um, Help me get my channel going. Please thank you so much for watching me. And until the next one, bye.